I know. He was driven by his sense of duty. But he had to be stopped before he suffered even more. Come now. But in the end, it was you who were cut down. Fear not. I will stop him loyally, as you once did. Mega! Shall we make our way to the Satsuma Villa in Edo? <laughs> Indeed. Imagine how lovely that would be. As you wish. I'd hear. You came all this way to see me, after all. Talking with you like this, you're not the same person as when first I met you. Back then, you seemed so fierce, so free. But now, I know there is much more to you. <sighs> betray you. Despite your great strength, I see the sadness dwelling there. You must have seen your share of trouble in the past. And a few wounds that have never healed, I should think. You might say I have a sense for these things. You know, you're terribly kind. You came to my rescue when I was in peril, did you not? I wish I could convey the joy I felt. The sheer relief when I set eyes upon you. I can almost imagine a day when I might utterly entrust myself to your care. <laughs> oh dear, I've said rather too much, haven't I? I blame your eyes. They're so easy to get lost in. Shall we make our way to the Satsuma Villa in Edo? As you wish. How remarkable! What is it? For my own reasons, I became a geisha of my own volition. But there are many here who cannot say the same. Most come into this life either because of poverty or punishment. Whatever it is, they all have their reasons. Please, don't go around prying into every girl's story. Oh, 
I've known about you since long ago. All sorts of talk echoes around the walls of the Pleasure District each night. The wheels spinning in Edo, Kyoto, a whole nation. Of course I was going to hear about a fearsome Ronin appearing in Yokohama. I look forward to seeing what you get up to next. Well, I wouldn't mind devoting my time to the shamisen, <laughs> which is more or less what I do now, of course. Although, playing as a geisha for one's customers is quite different from playing to indulge one's creative spirit. Perhaps one day, if I ever leave this place, it might be wonderful to explore the arts I learned for my trade. Yes, together. So you decided to join us. The Blue Demon's forces are marching on Princess Atsuko. It seems there is dissent in the Shogun's ranks. If they take custody of the Princess, the Satsuma clan will become hostages. You're the one who brought Fumi back. You have my gratitude. Now we no longer have our hands tied. Leave this to us. You should get somewhere safe. Please, take care of yourself. I'll be waiting. Now to support the Satsuma. Are you ready? to be part of this band. Indeed. I'll do my best not to disappoint. We must find Princess Atsuko before the enemy does.
nicely done. Here we go! 
thought the stray cat would wander in. Still, you did well. You have my thanks. <clears throat> Out of the way. My lady, we will soon have dealt with the vermin in the grounds. I thank you. It seems all is going according to plan. I'm afraid I must bring something to your attention. What did you say? down our arms, at least for today. But do not be disheartened. His dream will live on. Together, we will continue his legacy. Thank you once again for your efforts. It pains me, but now we can do little more than wait. 
I will seclude myself in my inner chambers. You have no need to fear for me. Even the chief minister would not dare come for me there. With my stepfather now gone, the Satsuma clan will be shaken to its core. Its future depends on you and Saigo. But we lack experience, and our master is gone. You know Saigo better than anyone, do you not? Compensate for each other's weaknesses, and secure the clan's future. Yes, my lady. I thank you. Now, what did you say your name was? <laughs> then you're astray with the sense of humor, it seems. Well, Princess Sato, aren't they odd? I look forward to speaking with you when things calm down. Until next time. Please forgive me, my lord. I did not foresee the stubbornness of the priestess. You have been taking matters into your own hands, it seems. But at least the princess has been subdued for now. Fine work, but you are relieved of your duties for now. Go, rest. Yes, sir. What will it be? Please, come again. Here to pay your respects at Tucker's grave? Someone's done it up recently. Perhaps her relatives. When she turned up here with Fumi, I knew I'd found a steadfast comrade. There was something about her. I could never fully let my guard down around her. Her death is a tragedy. But part of me is almost relieved. Sorry, I don't mean to speak ill of the dead. If she hadn't been mixed up with us, Perhaps she'd still be alive. I'll go and pay a visit myself later. Whoever she truly was, we owe her our lives. Hey! Over here! What can I do for you? be going now. What is it? Good idea. I've got some time on my hands now, if you're free. Ah, there was something I've been meaning to ask, actually. About the one who trained you. You've mastered the sword, no doubt. 
But that's not all. You've got real grit. I've never seen anything phase you in the least. You must have had an incredible master. Like we had in Master Shoin. To have their pupil revere them is a master's greatest joy, I'm sure. We were truly blessed to have been introduced to the man. He gave us purpose, the chance to focus on our nation's future. By the way, what does your teacher do these days? I see. The Shogunate. They rule by suppressing the will of the people. Truly, the Shogunate has lost its way, and there is no salvaging it now. Not only do they ignore the cries of the populace, but now they bend to the barbarians knocking at our door. It beggars belief. Can't they see how their people suffer with this disease they have invited into our home? Japan must change, and no one can do it but us. We, who were born and live under the rising sun. I'm sure you've had your fair share of painful memories. But let us together put this broken land to rights. What do you want? Really? All right, fine by me. Later then. You've heard about Tucker's death, I trust. <laughs> I just... Don't stop thinking about it. Ever since we met in Yokohama, she's done so much for us. And we had some fun in the Pleasure District, didn't we? But she was never just a regular geisha, was she? She took an extraordinary risk when she helped Fumi escape. She knew the likely consequences, but still she did the right thing. She may have looked like a flower, but she stung like a bee. If I'm going to do anything for Japan's future, I need to show the same commitment she did. Genzu is already working on a new plan, but I need some time to get things straight in my head. Why don't you pay a visit to Taka's grave? It's right here, in Saihoji Temple. Let us pray for her. Taka, I am afraid I cannot stay long. I must fulfill my duty.
under the Shogun, I will muster the power of the nobility and imperial court, strengthen our military, and negotiate a new treaty. A fairer one that shall protect our people and our wealth. Are you lonely, dearest Taka? Well, hold on. I won't be long. And when I join you, I shall give you the most exquisite hairpin you have ever seen. It seems Gensui's latest plan is coming together. We're just waiting for everyone to get here. Ever since Gensui read Master Shoin's last words, he's been all fired up about forging a new Japan. In fact, I'm pretty sure he's gearing up to attack the Red Demon's men head on. What do you think? Can you handle the fight? Good. Then let's do this, together. We've made arrangements to that end. That's true. Hmm. You always pop up at just the right moment, don't you? <sighs> Roma, look at this. Every last one of them is here to help us strike down the Red Demon. Hmm, truly an impressive sight. Firstly, I would like to thank you all for joining us. We all come from different domains, places with separate customs, different loyalties, in fact, some of our clans once opposed each other long ago. Yet we have cast aside our differences and come together. Truly a testament to Master Shoin. We must strike in the name of all who have been oppressed. Let us not forget the pain of Master Shoin and the countless others who have suffered we will bring this darkness to an end and deliver divine retribution to the Red Demon! I am allowed as many guards as the Shogunet provides. Do you expect the Chief Minister to flout the rules? Demons in the 
So good. This is my fate. 
to die at the hand of a long veiled edge. I could not help if I pledged to protect. The Red Demon was assassinated outside the Sakurada Gate of Edo Castle. They were saying the trade talks are being suspended. And you mm. just believe them, did you? You try arguing. I don't welcome the taste <laughs> of steel, personally. I... Wait, who are you? In the wake of this incident, Shogunate authority plummeted as the rebellious samurai grew emboldened. The influence of the United States, which Yi had done so much to promote, waned, leaving the door open for the British to take their place. After their triumph at the Sakurada Gate, Kusaka and his allies plot the next step in their quest to expel the foreigners. Could be a lot worse, right? It won't be easy for them to find us in here. Lots of constables on patrol tonight, too. It'd be too risky to camp outdoors. This was definitely the right choice. Thanks again. 
I really owe you for getting between me and E. <laughs> With luck, the Shogunate will change how they operate. Any idea what you'll do next? Personally, I'm going to talk to Katsura and see what he's up to. Ah, I should have known. You know, I seem to recall Katsura mentioning them not so long ago. Why not see if he can tell you anything useful? You should drop by the Choshu clan's villa. Well, I'll be off then. See you later. Excellent. I just arrived myself. Come on, let's head inside. Good to see you both. Listen, the British are building their legation on Gotenyama, and our plan is to burn it down. Naturally, it's not going to be easy. So I've asked a few of our younger comrades to lend us their assistance. Our people have also been watching the comings and goings at the legation. Their reports include mention of a samurai with a peculiar hand. Must be the samurai you're looking for, right? Well, what do you say to helping us out? Marvelous. My thanks. Ryoma, would you consider joining us too? Your presence would be much appreciated. I hear the legation was a parting gift from the Red Demon. Makes it hard to ignore. So yeah, I'm along for the ride. My thanks. Now, I know I'm the one asking for your help, but I don't think I'll be able to join you. I'm in the middle of talks with the Lord of Choshu and his chief retainers. Genzui and the others have assembled near Gotenyama. Can I count on you to go? I imagine you've got things to take care of. Let's meet around Gotenyama later. Look at this place. It's more like a fortress. Indeed. With the Americans fading from the scene, the British are making a show of their power. When they finish that damn thing, we're in trouble. We'll never get them out. Kasaka! Hmm? Hmm? Yamagata, what took you so long? Anito, glad you could make it. <laughs> it's a terrible shame what happened to Master Shoen. <laughs> but mark my words, I will personally make sure his death wasn't in vain. Mr. Takasugi. It's been quite a while. Ito, I've got the job for you. I want you to put on a firework show. And by that you mean... destroying a certain building? Exactly. Now the Red Demon's gone, the foreigners are next. Let's torch them in the cholera they brought. The 
smoke will rise as a beacon for our cause.
like you've got deep pockets. Hey, Take this! <laughs> 